Hey, what's up audio heads? It's your wingman mag 320 and I'm back with another video today this time with the Shure SRH 840 studio headphones here Now these set of headphones here are actually pretty comfortable for about $121 I believe it was you can actually get these from like I said before B&H photo Amazon Guitar Center or wherever that you get your uh, tech your audio and tech products from these are pretty much the headphones here pretty much lightweight and um, Nice and soft as a matter of fact now unlike the previous headphones that I have for you guys Which is the the so drops from a uh, ghost tech um, these are ones that are actually truly fit for the studio which they have the wire here as well as the um, headphone jack and the quarter inch jack for um, for the DJ booth and studio gear that you, whatever you guys have these are definitely a good set of headphones here um, from these are from Shures let's go ahead and uh, dive right into it and um, see what they're about Okay, so pretty much right out of the box, you can definitely see that these type of headphones are um, worth the price here. Um, has the two additional pure ear pads as well as the detached cable, which um, I'm actually gonna show that to you. Um, plus the carrying case, which is actually leather. Definitely, oh, it has a two year warranty to it. So it has a two year warranty and close back circum gnarl. I need to start getting my words in. Expand my vocabulary here. <laughs> uh, so yeah, these are, it doesn't have much else to actually put on the box here, which they should have. Um, so they had the, the paperwork that was here. Um, they usually include the paperwork in there. So yeah, they had the paperwork here. They had the coiled cables. So the coiled cable, as well as the headphone jack there. Um, these are actually really nice headphones to actually use. I already have a, a decent set of headphones that I can use for the studio itself, but if I need to um, really listen to like the bass line or the mid frequencies or anything like that, these are definitely a good uh, set of headphones to use here. So like I said, right out of the box, halfway decent presentation. I would definitely recommend these um, for the for the long term, even though it's leather and sometimes leather leather kind of breaks if you use it uh, quite a bit. Um, I had a, I had a pair of Sony's that I was using um, at a professional DV, DJ headphones. I forgot the name of them right now, but definitely have in, in, indicators here as well to uh, uh, to um, how to correctly put on the headphones, which is a halfway decent touch there very soft has the black color to them very stylish um, definitely something that you can uh, you know break out the bag and uh, put them on really quick so yeah um, I definitely would recommend these for anybody that is in the studio for uh, for relatively cheap price there isn't oh there is actually something I actually am kind of not fond of here these specific wires here um, at the um, at the, on the sides here, I'm not really fond of those to be honest with you, because they kind of stick out. So if you kind of pull on them a certain way, I don't think they're going to really last long. And that's that's the re that was actually the reason why I didn't I didn't like them too much. So yeah, these wires kind of will, will pull, and I'm not yeah I'm not really a, a real good fan of those there because they can actually pull out kind of easily. So what they should have done as far as like the design is concerned, could it at least, you know put it at least down through the inside of the, um, the 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 headphones themselves that way it'll be less prone to like bending or pulling or anything like that because you know that can sometimes be an issue there but other than that everything else is pretty much a sleet i don't see any real complaints for them um both this the it's pretty soft at the top there and it's it doesn't have that too much weight to put onto your head um and it's pretty it's pretty tight around the the um around as as Pretty tight around the dome, as a matter of fact. Yeah, it's pretty tight there, so it won't it won't just you know pull off that quick. So yeah, I would definitely recommend these kind of headphones for anybody that's in the studio here. So these go for about one hundred twenty one dollars. Definitely pick these up when you get the chance, or if you have like a slush fund or whatever. And yeah, so if you have any other sort of uh, headphones or microphones or any other type of audio products that you like for me to review on this channel, unbox and review, definitely uh, destroy that like button, drop a comment, subscribe, you know, the, the whole night, and definitely let me know so I can, um, you know, go across some other products here. The next thing I'm going to be talking about is the the Samsung G Track Pro. Did I say Samsung? Samson. Samson. Sorry, Samson. This is a, a USB microphone that I'm going to be unboxing this in the next video. So definitely look out for that. 
And yeah, if you have anything else that you'd like to recommend, definitely let me know. And I will see you guys in the next video.